Hi, my name is Jamie, and today I'm going to talk about managing and deploying profiles using the vSpace management server. This will be a two-part series in which, in the first part, I will show you how to capture a profile from an already configured N400 or N500 client. First off, let's jump into it and launch up the vSpace management server and log on using the default username and password of VMC admin or both. Once logged in, select device management and then manage devices to bring up a list of all the clients you already have signed up to your management center. The client that you want to capture the profile from will already have to be registered with the management server before you can proceed with this. Once you have located the client using the search or from the list below, click the tick box next to it and select store profile from the top right. Give the profile a name, for example, test profile. Select OK and this will then capture a profile of all the settings that you have configured up on this client. Once the profile is saved, you might then need to edit the profile with some additional configuration. You can do this by going to Device Management, Manage Profiles, locating the test profile that you just created, selecting View Edit Profile, and then you'll get a list of all the settings that you can modify within the vSpace Management Console. For example, I might need to change the Citrix URL to point to a different web interface site. To do this, you can select the Zen Desktop tab, locate the name and URL, and change it to your new URL, for example, HTTP Desktop. Once you've done this, select Next. You can then go through the rest of the tabs to confirm the settings or make any tweaks. To save time, I'm just going to jump to the Summary tab. From here, you can automatically review everything that you've saved. Once you're happy with the settings, select apply and this will distribute out to the rest of your rest of your N400 or N500 that you've already got saved. But you currently have no N400 or N500 clients configured to this profile yet. So that's the next step we'll have to take. So go to device management, manage devices, locate any of the clients that you want the new profile to be saved to. Tick these Select Apply Profile, excuse me there, you'll get that if you select a two clients with a different model. So I'll go back there, take away the N500 and select two N400s, select Apply Profile, select the new profile you want to deploy, click OK, and then this will then deploy out a profile to the clients you've already got configured. The clients will have to be online before you can deploy a profile out, otherwise the settings will not be picked up. Once you've deployed the client out, you can then go to your N400 or N500, log into the settings, and then have a look and make sure the settings have been saved correctly. Sometimes the client may need a reboot before it picks up the new settings. That's it for the first part of this series. I'll join you on the second part where I'll talk through how to create a new profile using the vSpace management server and go into a bit more detail on with what the settings you can set up. If you want to find more detail or any more blogs regarding and computing, Citrix, Microsoft, you can visit our website www.withlight.co.uk or follow us on Twitter at Withlight. Thank you for listening. Goodbye.